Hey guys, what's going on? This is your boy Yip Yip Yoshi. I just wanted to go ahead and make a quick video based off of the new update that came out for the PS4, which is the 4.5 update. Uh, I'm not going to go into all the details of it, but I will touch upon the biggest feature that came about, which is the external hard drive feature. Um, so for all you Xbox One fans that have uh, the habit and all, uh, like myself, uh, you know, they had external hard drive support already, but now PlayStation finally has it through this update. So I want to just go ahead and touch upon how to uh, set it up. So right now I do have my hard drive plugged in to the PS4 and I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to go into settings and then you would think it'd be located in storage, but it's actually not. Go all the way down to your devices page and then go down to USB storage devices and then you should see your USB device here now I got myself a four terabyte hard drive from Amazon uh, I got it for a pretty good deal as well I think it was when there was like a sale going on uh, so definitely poke around uh, look around the internet for a good deal I feel like you know just getting one terabyte extra is more than enough However, I just got a four terabyte just in case. Uh, you know, I don't know what games I'm gonna get digitally. Uh, I do get a lot more now, so I decided to just go ahead and do a four. So go ahead and click your device, and then you'll see the device like this. You know, specifications and information, um, and then go ahead and click on the format as extended storage. So it'll basically just walk you through the process. Uh, saying that you know you can install applications on it uh, no save data or anything can be on it though and then when you format it all the data will all the data will be deleted so if you do use a USB device that has data on it be weary because uh, yeah you will lose that data so I'm gonna format and then yeah, it'll basically tell you once or alert you once again. Uh, just click yes. And then depending on the size of your device, it'll you know take however long it needs to take. But yeah, once it's done, you should have your device all set up and you can download whatever applications you want from the PlayStation Store and then you should be able to install it on the hard drive itself so yeah the device now has been formatted and we can install on the storage now you just have to basically choose in the settings and under storage uh, where you want to install the application um, and you can stop it as well it says as well but I'm gonna pretty much hold on to it so right now I'm gonna go back I will go into storage and now you'll see that there's extended storage here as well and then basically we can move whatever applications that we want over there um, but that's you know kinda up to your preference uh, so I think if you do that if you do the options button on any one of the applications or games you should be able to see this option that says move to extended storage so yeah hopefully this video helps you out uh, if it does you know uh, leave a like, uh, leave a comment down below if you need any help as well. Uh, I'll try and help out. But remember, this is only for the latest update 4.5, uh, not for any updates prior or versions prior to this one. Um, so yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. Leave a like, uh, c comment, subscribe to the channel as well. I'd really appreciate that. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.